Hey guys, it's My Perfect Pet World here, and today's video is going to be the start of my taming process with Peach. So I just want to show you the setup quickly. I've got a few toys here and there. I've got like a little hide for her, her food bowl, her water bottle, her wheel, and then as you can see all the way around here, I've got cardboard that I've just kind of duct taped together. Obviously I'll watch her to make sure she doesn't chew that. And then I've got some boxes and then underneath I've got a fleece just so that she doesn't accidentally maybe pee or poo on the carpet and that way it's easier to just clean this rather than the carpet. So all I'm doing is letting her roam around this whole area. Right now she's right next to me and I'm just going to do this for about half an hour, just kind of sit here, do whatever, let her run around with me in here, and I'll see how that goes for today. So I'd also like to say that in her cage, before I actually have done this, she's actually been in a, um, her cage for like about a month now. I kind of did start this process late, but she has kind of gotten used to you know, me kind of giving her treats. I just sometimes pick up her food and just kind of hand feed it to her and she takes it from me well. And so I did that before. I also got some toilet paper as her bedding, uh, ripped it up and, you know, I just kind of had my scent on it and everything like that, just so she's kind of used to my scent and everything like that. So... I also have some food in my palm, as you can see right now. She's kind of behind me, so I don't think she's even... Oh, there she is. And she'll just take some from me every once in a while, as you can see there. Another thing that I do want to mention... Um, under there, as you can see, there's kind of a little gap. But that doesn't matter because I'm going to be in here the whole time. So I can just make sure she doesn't get under that. And here she can possibly climb over there. But once again, I'm in here the whole time. If you are going to get bored for sitting from sitting here for like half an hour or something like that. I mean, it can be shorter. It can be like 15 minutes or something like that. But if you're still going to get bored, you can just watch a YouTube video, listen to your music. It's just kind of so that the hamster kind of gets used to you. And you can also pick up the hamster. You can try. And that's another good thing about having a blanket. Just so if the hamster falls, it's on something comfy, not just the hard floor. And another thing is that you don't have to do this in like a pen or something. You can do this in a bathtub. Just if you're going to do that and you're going to pick up the hamster and stuff, make sure that you have a blanket down just so that if you pick it up, and it jumps that it doesn't fall on the hard bathtub and hurt itself. So I'm going to be ending the video in a minute here. As you can see, she's trying to get out. And the only time I've really picked her up during this was when she was trying to get out over the edge. There she is running right now. I just kind of put my hand out so that she didn't go over the edge and she just kind of climbed onto my hand. So I'd like to apologize for the bad lighting and the short video. I decided to do this during the night because obviously she's awake then rather than me waking her up in the middle of the day to do this. I'm probably going to be doing this again tomorrow night for a bit longer, maybe 40 minutes. Uh, and basically I just kind of let her run around. She climbed on me for a little bit and then I gave her some food out of, out of my palm as you saw. And she's really just kind of been doing her own thing. And that way she at least gets to know my scent and everything like that. And I'm going to give her a treat now and put her and everything else I took out of her cage back in. So I'm going to do that. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. And if you want to see a specific type of video, also leave that in the comments. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.